Now we do have nice weather this morning in mid Missouri do though have a little bit of fog in the area. Visibility is down to six miles for both Jefferson City and Columbia. Those seem to be the worst in the area as you head north of the capital. The lake is at nine. Perfect visibilities are when you do have 10 miles. That's what they have in Rolla. So be careful on that morning commute. Aside from the fog, our skies are clear, so it should burn up relatively quickly in the next hour or two. Temperatures there in the 70s. We have 72 for Sedalia and Como. Jeff City is at 71. Down south, the lake, they have an even 70 degrees. Look around the Midwest. Yesterday we were talking about an area of low pressure. That's over Texas producing showers and storms over the southern plains. That low is what brought us the rain yesterday and it could maybe bring us a few spotty showers today, especially for the folks south of Jefferson City. It's going to be tough though because high pressure is taking over. That's over the Ohio River Valley. That's going to throw in winds from the southeast, help to increase our moisture levels as well as our temperatures. So we are going to be hot and humid for today and in fact the next several days. Our by hour forecast shows those of us don't see any rain, which is going to be the majority will be partly cloudy by the time we hit the afternoon. Highs in the lower 90s feeling hotter than that though. Overnight we're going to dip into the 70s, mostly clear that high lingers, which means we continue to stay hot for tomorrow. Highs in the mid 90s heat indices in the triple digits Then we'll see that again as we move into Thursday. Now for today, 91 will do it. Heat index right around 95, 96. We have those clouds coming later in the day. Tonight, we're mostly clear, down to 71. Here's the seven day forecast. It shows temperatures breaking up to 93 tomorrow, then 95 on Thursday. Remember, heat indices will be in the triple digits during the afternoon. A cold front's coming for the weekend. That's gonna bring some showers and storms on Saturday, then a cool down to start next week.